It is the 19th of July 2018. Welcome to New Vision TV News around Uganda. I am Rethina Seji here. Look at stories making news around the country. that are from Kamuli District, where unknown arsonists said Kamuli Township Primary School boys dormitory on fire which consumed property worth millions. While narrating the Horoda story, Manhan Wage, a primary seven pupil at the school, said he saw people sneak into the school compound clad in black jackets. He said that while they were having evening preps, the dormitories caught fire. According to an eyewitness, who is also a parent of two children at the school, said the inferno started at around 8 30 p.m the witness lives near the school johnson luere the headmaster described the incident as a malicious act ahmed madiri the district police commander say the preliminary investigations show that it is an arson attack since they recovered three liter jerry cans with fuel which they believe was used to burn down the dormitory Moving on to Rukunjiri District, the police are investigating circumstances that led to the death of a 47-year-old teacher. The deceased identified as Kamu Kahambisa Becharika has been the teacher of Chabgashe High School. Becharika was founded in his house, which is located in Butagasi Cell, Chinyansano Ward in Rukunjiri Municipality. It is reported that at the time of his death, his wife was on a business trip in Kampala. According to Kiges Region Police spokesperson, Eli Mate, police rushed to the scene and took samples of food suspected to be poisoned, which was recovered as exhibit. Becharika's body is currently at Imbara Regional Hospital for post-mortem. We now take a break as we look at what is making news in today's copy of The New Vision. The Kampala Sun is also on sale today. It comes out every Friday. Let us take a look at what is making news in the Kampala Sun. For those who cannot access the hard copies of these two papers, all you have to do is to subscribe to our e-paper and access all the products published by Vision Group. Yes, still watching New Vision TV News with me, Rory Thina. Let us continue looking at more stories making news around Uganda from Jinja District. Residents of Butagaya Sub County are lamenting over the large number of dogs that has invaded their locality. According to Richard Munyegera, the El Suencha person of Kamura Village, the stray dogs have proceeded to eat up people's domestic animals, which include goats and pigs. Ronald Mayer, a resident of Kamira Village, added that the dogs have eaten his three goats in a period of six months. Margaret Nabidia, a resident of Namagir Parish, Butagaya Sub County, lamented that her ten piglets delivered by two souls were taken away by the wild dogs. Munyagera is worried that the dogs are fueling poverty in the area since animals or birds bought to boost household incomes are being lost overnight no one is aware where the dogs could have come from and their health status closing off the news around uganda is a story from luwere district where the uganda 
Muslim Supreme Council is to undertake a multi-billion project to construct nine regional Muslim headquarters that will coordinate Muslim affairs countrywide. Moft Ramadan Mubadjah has said the new development comes in a wake of the recent move by the old Kampala best Uganda Muslim Council to decentralize service delivery by creating nine semi-autonomous Muslim regions. Each Muslim region is to be headed by the region General Kadi, who will be directly reporting to the Muft. Mubaji said this recently. He stated that each of the regional headquarters is to have a regional mosque, schools, a vocational institute, a healthy center, and an administration block, as well as an income generating project. Mubaji made the remarks at the consecration of, of Sheikh Mustafa Ule as the pioneer regional Kadi for East Uganda Muslim region. That is all we had for you. Thank you for watching. Be sure to catch my news updates and other programs here on New Vision TV by visiting our website, which is newvision.co.uj forward slash video. You can also follow us on social media. Facebook is the New Vision. Twitter is at New Vision Wire. Instagram is at New Vision Wire. And our YouTube channel is New Vision TV. Catch up with me on my Twitter handle. I am Ruth, the voice. Thank you for watching.